Hey guys, I'm Bill from GCFLearnFree.org and today we're going to be taking a look at Chromebooks. Now you might have heard of a Chromebook before, you might not, but either way if you're thinking about buying a new computer, a Chromebook might be a really good low cost alternative to a traditional laptop. Now unlike normal computers which use the Windows or Mac operating system, a Chromebook uses Chrome OS, which is based on the Google Chrome web browser. That means you can use a Chromebook to do just about everything you do in a normal web browser, like checking your email, Facebook, watching videos, creating simple documents, and a whole lot more. This is actually a Chromebook right behind me. It has a screen, keyboard, and touchpad, just like a regular laptop. It's pretty thin, it's pretty light. It's got most of your basic ports, like headphones, HDMI, USB, USB again over here. That might vary based on which Chromebook model you buy, but more about that later. Let's take a look at the basics of using the Chromebook interface. This is the Chromebook desktop, and it might look pretty familiar to the desktop of a regular Windows or Mac computer if you've ever used one before. If you click this button in the lower left corner, you can open any app on your Chromebook. For example, if you wanted to create a new document, you could just click here. You can also use a Chromebook just like a regular web browser. Create a new tab and use it to go to any web page you want. Because a Chromebook runs Chrome OS, you can't install traditional software that you might already own. Still, there are a lot of great applications here and many of them are free. Okay, so those are just the absolute basics of using a Chromebook, but I hope this video has been helpful in showing you what a Chromebook can and can't do. If you're thinking about buying a Chromebook, I'd invite you just to take some time and think about your needs as a computer user. A five or $600 laptop may actually do much more than you need, and I think for a lot of people, a Chromebook would make a really great alternative. On the other hand, if you need access to very specific Windows or Mac software, a Chromebook just might not cut it for you. Anyway, I hope this video has been helpful for you, and check out our Chromebooks lesson for even more information. GCF Global, creating opportunities for a better life.